Hi, this is JC. Um, I haven't done a video in a while and I apologize. I'm sure you understand the holidays things are always really busy and I've had a lot going on. But I decided I wanted to do one today and if you hear the heat going, I apologize, or you hear the wind blowing, it's extremely windy today. So what I'm going to do first is this dollar haul. And all of this is from the Dollar Tree and this is about three different visits accumulated so it may be a little long but I'm gonna try not to drag it out and a lot of it is Christmas because those of you who are Dollar Treeers know um, you always have to grab the holiday stuff because you don't know how long it's gonna be around but I will say this year it seems that they're restocking a lot for uh, Christmas things so I am finding new things when I go back but let's just get started um, first off, let's see, let's do some non-Christmas first and then we'll finish up with Christmas. I got these metallic markers to use in my planner and what have you. Um, real pretty, a gold, a gray, a purple, and a pink. And they did have other colors as well. I thought those were cute. Another set of these pens, which I absolutely love. These are the gel pens and I have tons of them and I just... One of the rare pens I use until I use them up because I just like the way they write. And they write kind of like, I've said it before, kind of like the old-fashioned fountain pens. Really like it. And then this magnetic notepad, which I thought was really cute. It has Monday through Sunday. And then a little cooking utensils on the bottom. And I got this um, because it does have a magnet and it goes on the refrigerator. And so I'm going to kind of plan out my meals, my dinners on here. So I don't have to go in there and say, well, what am I going to have for dinner? You know, kind of help to plan that out. Not that I always stick to plan, but that's what I got. And then, let's see, some more non-Christmas. Um, I got some uh, sticker notes. Whoops, I've got glitter all over them. Thank you, Santa. Um, just these sticker notes that I can use in my planner and what have you, organi organizing and I hope they are like the regular paper sticker notes. I have bought some there that were um, plastic and they did not stick very well. So I hope these are just like the regular, you know, sticker notes. So I'm gonna try those. And then let's see, I'm trying to find everything that's not Christmas. A lot of it is. Um, okay, I got, well, this kind of is. I'll save that next. Um, I thought this would be fun. I was going through the kids, and this is a sponge ball shooter. Just a little gun. And I probably should have got some more um, if I venture back that way, but these would just be fun to, with the kids. I'm going to my nieces and her family for Thanksgiving, and they've got three little girls, and this would be fun. So I should, probably should have got more of those. And this... Um, Solar Dancing Turkey. I love these solar toys. I'm, I'm kind of started collecting them. And this one's a little turkey and his little neck wobbles. So I'm anxious to get him out of the package and see how he works. So I got that one. And then I was when I was in the kids section, um, I had to get it. I just had to. And I'll show you what it looks like in the package. I've already torn him out of the package and tried it. Um... This is the, let me see if I can get this so you can see it, the authentic Bigfoot call. First off, how do they know it's authentic? Have they heard a Bigfoot call? Because I can tell you right now, this does not sound like the Bigfoots I've seen. Unlike all those shows you watch, um, I did take them out of the package. And what it is, is you have to blow through this end, and I'm not going to do it because I got lipstick on, but you have to blow through this, and then the sound comes out here, and it says, um, let's see, growl, gently blow into the mouthpiece to create low-pitched Bigfoot growling sounds, and then forcibly blow into the mouthpiece to create a shrieking Bigfoot yell. Um, it don't sound like any Bigfoot I've ever heard, <laughs> and again, how do they know it's authentic. <laughs> it's just, I don't know. It makes a terrible sound. It's real high, um, almost screech. 
not like any Bigfoot I've ever heard on those shows. But it was it's fun for a buck. All right, I think, oh, one more thing. I think everything else is Christmas. Um, I got this book by Claudia Gray called The Spellcaster, and it sounded interesting. A boy cursed with visions that lead to madness. A girl granted the powers to save him. So, it looks interesting. I'll read it. I don't know why I keep buying these books. I haven't had a chance to read any of them. Um, but, for a dollar. If nothing else, you could, you know, give it away for a Christmas gift if you need a stocking stuffer. I picked up this scarf, which I think is adorable. Let me get it where you can see it. It's Santa Claus's and candy cane. I'm not Santa Claus. Ugh. Uh, snowman and candy canes. Really cute. And they had three or four different styles of this. But I thought this one was really, really cute. I like the green for Christmas. And then a couple more of these solar things. The solar dancing snowman, which are his eyes are kind of creepy, aren't they? But he had a choice of like four, and these were the ones I wanted. So a little snowman and Santa. And Santa rocks. I don't know if you can see him. He rocks in his chair with these sellers. And he's checking his list. Got that. And I'm going kind of fast, but I got a lot of stuff. And then I got a couple of these light up things. This one has red birds and what have you on it. And I guess they're supposed to be trees. And I'll try one of these I could not get to work. I don't know if I'm gonna take it back or not. This is the one that doesn't work, which is fine. I think it's pretty just decorated. This one works. This one goes. I don't know if you can I don't think you can see. Yeah, there's a green. And it'll turn red, blue, turns different colors. So I picked up two of these. I probably won't even turn them on. I think they're pretty just the way they are. So I got those. And flowers, little red. Christmassy looking flowers. They're real sparkly. Real sparkly. Just gonna put them in a vase. Real sparkly. And then I picked up this little train. This is the it's a wind up train set. It has a little track. And what I like about it is I I'm gonna put these like around a candle. I think that'd be so cute. And I actually had to buy uh, I bought two, one for me and one for my nieces, because um, I had to give one away. I had to make up uh, a present for a thing at church. And I just thought that was so cute. And it would be real cute around. I gave away a candle and then this. And I thought it would be really cute around the candle. So I got that. And then, um, I'll do that. I got these boxes, which are kind of Christmassy, I think. Uh, Faith, Hope, Love, the greatest of these is love. And it's just got a magnetic clasp. It's just a box with a magnetic clasp. Got that one. And then, live well, laugh often, love much. And again, these would be really cute, again, for uh, inexpensive Christmas gifts. Somebody you just want to give something. May God bless you with love, uh, with love and laughter. And I thought these would be real cute if you just fill them up with those um, green and red Hershey Kisses. Those would make nice little presents. So I got those. And... I thought these were, oh, uh, I don't know why I bought this. I don't know if I'd be brave enough to wear it, but I thought it was cute, little Santa on your head. Little Santa. <laughs> and again, they had several different ones of these. They had uh, reindeer antlers and um, I can't remember what all, but they did have other Christmas things like this. And I thought these were so cute. These are um, just little plushes. You have the little elf. And then you have the... Let me pull her skirt down. You have the girl elf. Aren't those cute? And they're soft. They're really, really soft. I would not give these to pets to play with. Because they'd probably tear them up really quickly. Because they're, they're just really soft. 
So, but I thought those were cute, like sitting on a shelf or something like that for Christmas. And, oh, and don't think I won't wear this. Um, as soon as Christmas is, you know, as soon as Thanksgiving passes, I will wear this. This is, then they had, mm, I don't know if I had these the last time I was in there, but when I went into a Christmas tie, it says ho, ho, ho with Santa on it, and you push a button. Who does not need one of these? And they had several styles of these as well. So, don't think I won't wear that. Uh, oh, this isn't a Christmas thing. They got hid down there. I picked up a couple of these books. Um, one says, the best way to something done is to begin. It's just a journal, real shiny pink. And the other says, believe you can, believe you can, you are halfway there. I thought that would be real cute, again, for a stocking stuffer. And then, not that I bake a lot, but again, these would make a nice present, or uh, you could just, I've seen people just hang these on the tree. Some Christmas cookie cutters. There's like um, a Santa and um, that's, yeah, that's Santa. You can't see it very good, but that's Santa, Gingerbread Man, uh, Star. There's quite a few in here. It doesn't say how many. There are six cookie cutters in here. And again, I've seen people hang these on trees, which isn't bad for a dollar. And then, because I love them so, uh, and I hate to take down my, my Halloween ones and my fall ones. I've still got my Halloween ones on there. Um, I just hate to take her down. It's going to be sad when I do, when I take my little witch down. But um, I got these Christmas ones. This has a tree, and I love the little owl and the deer. And what have you. Can you see what's in there? That's what's in there. For your refrigerator. Hang on your refrigerator. And then to add to it, this has a snowman and another little owl and some snowflakes. Whoops. I even got a glare. You see that? Yeah, there you go. So, I thought these were really cute. And I think they had a couple other styles as well. And then, I'm telling you, this is a long one because there's just so much neat Christmas stuff. I got these uh, treat bags, again, for, you know, for Christmas to hand things out, probably at church and what have you. This is a Santa. Isn't he cute? He's so cute. And this has uh, Christmas candy on it. And there are 30 bags in each one. So that's not bad. Not bad at all. And a couple of plates for when we do Christmas things and I need something to put my cookies on that I cut out with my cookie cutters. Um, this was really cute. The Santa plate. Santa. And it's just a plastic plate, but I thought it was really cute. So I got Santa. And then this one says, tis the season to be jolly. And again, it's just a plastic, but it's not bad. It's not, you know, that bad. I'm trying to get it straight. It's a pretty good size plate. It really is. Um, you can see, yeah, it's pretty good size. The other one's a little bit smaller. And then one reason I went in there is, um, make sure I didn't forget anything over here. Went in there was to get these because we're doing Secret Sisters at church where you do a gift like for three weeks, every three weeks, one for every each week for three weeks. There we go. And then your big gift when we do the reveal party. And I needed bags. And if you go to even Walmart, uh, a good size gift bag is three or four bucks. So I needed to pick some up at the Dollar Tree. I thought this one was cute. It says, get the handle out of the way, tis the season. You can see it's a good size bag, tis the season. And I like to get things in bags because people can reuse them every year. Um, and then this is just a big old Santa face. Let's do it on the side. Isn't he cute? 
big old Santa face. And then this one caught my eye, and I may not use it as a bag. It says, let it snow. I may actually frame this, because I think it's cute. And it says, let it snow, and it's got a snowman, and an owl, and a present. And um, it's all sparkly. I don't know if you can see it. There you go. It's all sparkly. So I may actually frame this. And then I just got a small one, and it says, Go tell it on the mountain that Jesus Christ is born. I thought that was cute. I'm having a hard time getting in on the camera today. I usually sit further back, but I decided to do it closer. So I thought that was real cute. Real country looking. And then this just hit my eye. I normally don't buy um, towels and stuff from the Dollar Tree because I think they're a little thin. But... Um, I thought this was pretty, just the red and white, and if nothing else, just to put it on the stove for Christmas. I may go back and get a couple just for that, just to have them on my stove handle, because I do dress it up. And then a thing of antibacterial hand lotion, cranberry, cherry, vanilla, and Japanese blossom. Kind of Christmassy, not really, but I forgot it was laying over here. So I'll show you that. And then a coloring book, Happy Holidays. And it's got a, I just like it because it's, it's mainly just coloring book. There's a few connect the dots, but it's mainly just pictures, which is what, you know, when I do this with my um, nieces, daughters, my great nieces, I guess that's what you call them. Um, it's good to have, because when, when you're that age, you know, you don't want a lot of intricate places to color, and these have big areas, you know, that you can color. So, I picked that up. Oh, I guess this isn't Christmassy either. Again, just some tea. This is herbal chamomile and herbal peppermint tea. So, I picked up those. And a shiny red duct tape. These on packages. And finally, I was so surprised. Um, when I went around one corner and on the end cap they had all of these. And normally it takes me a long time to find my Christmas cards. Um, I'm really picky. And nine times out of ten I get them at either Target or somewhere like that. But I could not believe they had these at the Dollar Tree, and they're really cute. I mean, they're not fancy schmancy, but they're cute, I think. So I got this one. May your days be merry and bright. And it says, and your holiday season be filled with love and joy. And there's 16 cards in here for a dollar. So for four dollars, because each one of these has 16, I got, um, what is that, 54? Is that right? So 32, no, 60, 64. I got 60, yeah, 64 cards. So that's not bad at all for four bucks. So I got that one. This one just has a tree on the front, but it says, wishing you peace, love, and joy this holiday season. Thought that was cute. It's a weird noise I'm hearing. Um, happy, just happy holidays. And it says, may the Christmas season fill your home with joy, your heart with love, and your life with laughter. Cute. Cute, cute. And this one looks cute. It just says, ho, ho, ho. And it says, warmest thoughts and best wishes for a wonderful holiday and a happy new year. I mean, those are so cute. Because I usually send around 40 cards or so a year. And, I mean... These are nice. They're not... Let's see if I can get one out. Or if it's, oh, if I can get one out. I mean, again, they're not fancy schmancy, but they're nice. See? Just got the writing on the inside. It's a nice little card. And, you know, you don't... I don't know... Some people keep them. My mother kept them. Um, but, I mean, that's a lot of cards for four bucks. Sixty-four cards. So that's a good deal. So... That's all my dollar haul. That's a lot of stuff. Again, uh, they still have quite a bit of Christmas, um, surprisingly. But 
I hope you enjoyed that. As always, feel free to subscribe so I can tell you when another video is going up. Um, feel free to comment nicely and <laughs> give it a like. Um, everybody have a great holiday, have a great Thanksgiving, and I am going to do two more videos. I'm going to do a Lush haul and I'm going to do a makeup haul. So look for those. I'm going to try to get them done today. So I'll probably look just like this. You know, I'm not going to change clothes or do anything schmancy. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye for now.